Welcome to our fundamentals of SQL. In this course, or in this video, we're going to use the average function. This is Dr. Sherry Hutchinson and the voice of John Hutchinson. Thank you. Hi. In this video, we will be discussing a summary query um, using uh, average, the average function. Average function, uh, like the sum function, is only used with numeric uh, values. Count function, you could count uh, non-numeric things, dates, uh, names, strings, and so forth. You can count the number of names, but you can't sum names or you can't average names. So, but today we're going to talk about averages. It's called the average function. Now, let's say your employer asks you to average um, the retail price or the price of the different categories. And you know we have six different categories and you want to find the average price of the different categories. Okay, so let's do that. And, and he also wants to know, and to put it in a neat little table, to order them in a descending fashion the, the price that is the average retail price in a descending fashion. So let's do that. Let's select the category ID. Okay, let's average, that's AVG, the retail price. And let's call that average price from the products table then we're going to group by the category ID now let's let's um, order um, by the average price in a descending fashion. That is, we want the highest prices first by the category. So, look at that. <coughs> let's, let's comment this out so we don't run it again. We're only going to run. Let's see what happens when we hit execute. Okay. So if you look at it, category two had the highest average price of 1321.25 and the lowest average price was the category six items. So what this did is it selected the category IDs that were the same. So it took all the category IDs that were two and it took their average retail price and I put it under a column name average price from the product so it grouped by that so if you wanted to find the average price of all the products without regard to category that if that's what he asked you all you'd have to do is go back to your query comment out the category ID and the group by And you don't, don't need that either. So let's just look at the average price and hit that. The average price for everything was 196.0335. Thank you.